An eight-year-old girl who was killed when a Land Rover crashed into a primary school in south-west London has been named as Selina Lau. Her family have described her as an intelligent and cheeky girl, adored and loved by everyone. Another eight-year-old girl is in a life-threatening condition in hospital following the incident in Wimbledon, and a woman in her 40s is in a critical condition. It happened during an end-of-term party where tables and mats had been set up outside for the children. The first glimpse of where a little girl's life was cut short and where another eight-year-old girl has now been left in a life-threatening condition. This gap, where once stood a wooden fence obscuring the school, is now a window into what happened. And mourners can't help but imagine the horrors of Thursday morning. I'm looking at this steel fence which has been put up and in the place of a wooden fence that was smashed down by a large Land Rover. These are very small, old roads with narrow pavements and lots of children coming every day and I, I don't personally think that SUVs and four-wheel drives and Land Rovers should be on these roads. Witnesses told us they saw children underneath the vehicle as it crashed into the school grounds. Cards addressed Dear Selina describe her as a shining star and a bundle of joy. I can't believe that. I can't believe that. It's such a quiet road and I don't know what happened, how this thing happened, I can't, I can't even imagine. Questions that will take time to answer. A woman in her 40s thought to be a parent or carer of a student is in a critical condition in hospital. A number of others, including a seven-month-old baby, are also receiving treatment. At the parish church less than a mile away, it's the Reverend's first day. Her immediate task is to help this community start to heal. This is a devastating incident and, you know, nothing like it's happened before. So very much a community in shock, a community in pain, a community hurting. Now that the cordon has been lifted, it's the first time that we're able to see the extent of the damage that was done, only a few feet away from this main road. All day, people have been stopping by, having a quiet moment of peace and reflection and adding to that growing garden of flowers and messages, an acknowledgement that what happened here has been devastating. A 46-year-old woman behind the wheel of the car who was arrested on suspicion of causing death by dangerous driving has been bailed pending further inquiries. The Metropolitan Police are keen to squash speculation and reassure people here. But for the family of the eight-year-old who died, no amount of support will repair their end-of-term terror. Ashna Harinag, Sky News, in Wimbledon.